And welcome back, Baller Scuba here with another episode of Let's Play Xenogears. I don't know what I was going to say, but we are definitely watching Xenogears right now. This is Fei Fong Wong. He is joined by Doc Tanizuki and El Haim. El Haim, out, and we need to head through this door right here, which leads to a whole new area. Up? Question mark? Yes. This this does go up, doesn't it? Yes, yes it does. So why was there a question? Um what is the name of this place that we're going to? Let me look it up here for a second. We are headed to Krellian's Laboratory, yeah! Woo! Krellian's Laboratory! I do have my notes in front of me because I hate this place. I forgot the name of it. Um this place is a pain in the ass. So Really, if you want to bust out a map, there's no shame in that one on this place. Not here. Because th there's so much treasure to get here. Okay. So you start off in, like, the middle-ish here. And no, you cannot go through these doors. The door is locked. Yeah, thank you, dude. But there's treasure. I can see the treasure. Do we have new enemies while we're here? No, no, we do not. So let's head through the left door first, hopefully. We can find some good treasure here. I know there's a lot of treasure in this place. And I remember missing a lot of it the first time I, I was here and I had to come back and that was not fun. Is this... Is this the Rotten Sod? If it dies right now, it's definitely the Rotten Sod because this thing was not... I mean, it was a little bit tough, but it wasn't too tough. Oh, snap. And it healed itself. And it didn't give itself a name! What are you? Are you weak to Kake? Which I don't think we've seen before. And it's still kicking! Good lord, I might need to heal everybody after this. It's the orphan? <laughs> oh my god, okay, for- Oh, you stole my EP, you bitch! Now I will no longer laugh that your name is Orphan! And once again, it's a counter to death blows, but death blows do so much more damage right now than the regular attacks that I'm just gonna keep using them and he's just gonna have to die eventually. Don't steal my EP! You dick. You must die by Aqua Frost! That's eh, okay, I got a ton of Omega Sauce. Bounce! Bounce on the snowflake! For a thousand more damage, down it finally goes! Good lord, I do not like that thing. That orphan. And we get an Alpha Salt for our trouble, which is awesome. Let's head in here. What do we have? Just a big. Room. Oh, there is a treasure chest over here. What do we got? Aquasol DX. Not as good as that Alpha Sol I just got. What's on the computer? There you go. I don't know what's on the computer, so let's just let's just get the hell out of here and pretend that I didn't do anything. So let's head over to this side, where we can find uh, the same enemies. And down in this little nook. What do we have? We do have another save point, and I don't really know what's going on here. We got... Uh-oh. We got the save point memory cube manufacturing department. This is probably not a good place to be. We do find a survival tent, which is actually pretty handy. I might actually use that right here. Okay, let's... Get out of here! I don't like this. There are so many save points. I don't know what they're trying to tell me. <laughs> they're like, oh, the game's gonna really screw you over now. You better use every damn one of these. Okay. Um, I definitely don't like the this. What's going on here? Oh, there we go. Hit the lights. Oh my god, it's a gear. What is this thing? It's a gear. What? I, oh, seriously? Nobody listens to me. What? The surface of the armor isn't segmented. It's the same as Bart's gear and Avari and the gear we saw in Shavat. It's an Omni gear! But this thing is huge! Yes, it's gotta be around three times as powerful as our gears. So, 
This is Solaris' Omni Gear. Can can I have it? Can I teach Margie how to use it? Or, or Jesse? Then they can join our party. Please? Damn you, Satan. Let's keep going. Even though I want that gear. But it was underwater anyway. Um. Hey? What's up, dude? Yo, long time! It's me, the one who owned that dog in Kislev. I may look like this, but the dog's doing fine. Please, don't think about letting me out. Even though I'm still conscious, eventually I'll. Yo, what? Are you gonna talk to me? Apparently this guy cannot talk. Or does not want to. Can I... I feel like I need to do something to help them. But Will this do it? What's up? Good, good day. Into a fight? Into a boss fight? Oh, against Wells. Well, we haven't seen these in a long time. So let's use Willow Wind on them. Satan should be able to handle these guys. No problem. Wind through whatever. Nice. Down it goes. The Neo Wells. They're upgrades anyway. So these are new enemies. 264 damage and it exploded on Satan. And whatever. Whatever we see. Suke! Suke! I don't know how to say it. We haven't seen it. Damn. He's like, I will create ice around you and then shatter it. I think I like this combination the best just because of how I do it. Not necessarily how it comes across on, on the screen, but the death blow actually is. But I like doing, you know, triangle square, triangle X. So for those Neo Wells, we get 8450. So yes, these are what... These are what turn into wells, I guess. We get scales for our troubles. You opened it. I told you not to open it! Uh, my mind! My mind! Can we get another fight against Neo Wells? No, we get an orphan again. My. My dog. Please take care of him and then he disappears. But for our troubles, we get a muscle belt, which is awesome. Let's let this guy out. We can then kick his ass. Help me. My body. Now, I think that those are your only two options, Neo Wells and Orphans. Yeah, that's it. But I do want what's in this treasure chest right here. We get hot meat. I don't think that was even worth the battle. Well, it didn't really cost me anything. The elevator is locked. Must be controlled by the adjacent panel. Thank you. Can't get up there yet. I do want to get up there, but we can't do that yet. So we must continue on to the next little room. What do we have in here? More wells to fight. Any of you going to say anything to me before we get this started? Nope. Alright, let's do this. Whatever. And in this one we get... Hob steak! Better than the meat! Better than the meat. You have anything to say? These guys are much further along than the last one. But in here we get... An eyeball. Awesome. They keep eyeballs in treasure chests now. What do you got to say? I kind of feel like eating you up. And then it screams, but it's still the same fight. Oh. It's not the same fight. Die. And down it goes. You remember those things? I forgot what they were called. But yeah, they look like zombies, so treat them like zombies and just cure them to death. And in here we get an angelic robe. That is definitely new. Is that... I bet that's only something Ellie would be able to wear. Where is... She's on the crimson vest. Let's see if she can get the angelic robe. 
Vaden either defense up by 10 and her regular defense only down by 4. That sounds good to me. That sounds like a partial upgrade that I will accept. Is there... Oh, here's the elevator. Elevator is locked. Okay, I figured there was another one in here too, but I was hoping that would open up for me, but it did not. So I need to go this way through the purple doors for whatever reason, and why do you keep doing that now? Alright, through this first door up here, past the purple doors, because purple doors are always awesome, we get an extra AR plus six! Nice! I don't think we've gotten one of those before. But it doesn't look like Faye wants to play with any of these computers. But I do see a treasure chest in the next room, so let's go ahead and go over there. Give me something good. Daddy wants a new pair of shoes, he, but he got an eyeball instead. Apparently you can just run right on top of that. No problem there. I do kind of like this new little battle animation, though. Back out to the main room. Leave the... Apparently we have to open the purple doors again. Those are special doors. They don't just stay open for you. No, no, no. You gotta open them. They're purple. But over here we get a gold nugget. Like I said, there's a ton of treasure in this place. Like every freaking room. So you want to make sure you get to all of them. Which is why it's okay to bring a map if I'm being honest. And in here you get ha meat. I'm going to head back outside. And then we pretty much circle around a bit. Here's another door, let's go in it. This leads us to a big room with a table in the middle, with a treasure chest on top, with an Aquasol DX. I, I don't I don't understand the game. Security system lock off! Awesome, so we did finally turn off the security system, which means we can go up the stairs in the middle. Do you remember how to get there? No, I bet you don't, but luckily it's right here. And we're back where we started, but this time we can go through these doors right here. Open up these treasure chests, we get an Aquasol DX, and the survival tent! Awesome! Let's see, this leads us to another large room. And I think there are just elevators on both sides here. 